We've seen how simple machines can make work easier by trading force for distance. The thing is, they don't actually change the amount of work that's done. Moving a heavy load takes the same amount of work with and without a simple machine. You see, work is actually a technical term. It can be quantified and expressed mathematically. The formula for work is W equals F times D, or work is equal to force times distance. So if you lifted a 200 pound rock one foot into the air, you would have done 200 foot pounds of work. But let's say you lifted the same rock one foot in the air using a lever. With this lever, you only need 40 pounds of force to lift the rock, but you must move your end of the lever arm five feet to get the rock to rise one foot. Your 40 pounds times five feet still equals 200 foot pounds of work. Simple machines don't change the amount of work needed to move things. They simply change the numbers around a bit so we can do the same work using less force. To show this mathematically, you would use the formula work in is equal to work out. That means that the work you perform on the machine is always equal to the work the machine performs on the load. The work you put in is the same as the work you get out. If we expand this formula a bit, we can see all the variables. The input force times the input distance will be equal to the output force times the output distance. This is how you're able to lift a 200 pound rock one foot by applying only 40 pounds of force over five feet. This relationship between work, force, and distance exists with all simple machines.